They resemble humans, can mimic our actions, but still cannot fully replace us. However, they have already become great assistants. Today's video will discuss the most realistic humanoid robots in the world. As we know, in recent years, the humanoid robot industry has become more relevant than ever due to advancements in artificial intelligence. If the production of one robot per year used to be a sensation, now dozens of advanced humanoids are being released annually. The leaders in robotics are Japan, China, and the United States. Currently, these countries have the most advanced robots in terms of both capabilities and appearance. But there is one company that has challenged the world, and for several years, has been creating some of the most realistic robots in the world, surpassing even competitors from countries like the USA and China. Today we will be talking about robots from the Russian company Promobot. We will explain how the Russians make their humanoids so indistinguishable from humans, show the process of creating robots at the largest factories in Russia, and explore their characteristics and the future prospects of the Promobot company. Promobot is the largest manufacturer of autonomous service robots in Russia and Europe, specializing in mechatronics, electronics, artificial intelligence, the creation of artificial skin and muscles, and the study of human-machine interaction. The company's headquarters are currently located in the Morian Digital Technopark in Perm. Promobot was founded in January 2013 by Oleg Kivokurtsev, Maxim Utev, and Igor Yeremeyev. Their first robot was 145 centimeters tall and weighed 70 kilograms. Initially, Promobot was designed as an assistant focused on solving specific tasks. It started as a snow-clearing robot, then evolved into a consulting robot with facial recognition and the ability to have conversations and answer questions. Following this, they developed a companion robot, an administrator robot, a secretary robot for document management support, a medical robot, a security robot, and many others. The Perm-based company manufactures the circuit boards for its robots in-house and holds more than 10 patents for its developments. Promobot operates in several areas, but its true breakthrough came with the creation of ultra-realistic robots that brought the company global recognition. These robots have human-like appearances and facial expressions, can speak and express emotions, thereby attracting even more attention. Their robots are equipped with movable arms that mimic human gestures to interact with audiences and also scan documents for people, recognize data and transfer it to information systems, measure body temperatures, and much more. Now let's move on to the robot creation process. We head to one of the company's largest factories and begin assembly. After all the blueprints and plans are completed, engineers start by building the robot's frame, which is made from lightweight aluminum, while the joints are made from steel. Simultaneously, the plastic is prepared and undergoes thermovacuum forming. The parts are then processed, painted, and installed on the robot. Also, every plastic part in a Promobot undergoes fireproof treatment. On average, each robot contains about 56 plastic parts, and the client can choose any color for the body. Next, engineers lay out the wiring, install circuit boards, servos, and the processor. This results in the installation of the specific devices needed for the robot's tasks, a printer, document scanner, banking terminal, or medical equipment. Promobot robots operate on a specially developed Linux operating system. Programmers and linguists work on developing the linguistic base, speech and facial recognition systems, and autonomous navigation. On average, it takes about five days to assemble one humanoid. The factory always has several Promobots being assembled simultaneously. Each year the company produces several hundred humanoids, but its production capacity is growing, and with sufficient demand production can be doubled. The creation of the hair is perhaps the most time-consuming and meticulous task, as it is done entirely by hand. Each hair strand receives individual attention, and there can be up to 100,000 hairs on a single head. The hair used is real as synthetic hair lacks the necessary curl and elasticity. To ensure the hair looks presentable, a professional hairdresser is brought in for each robotic head. The eyes are also painted by hand, with the iris and pupil detailed using a fine brush. It takes two days to complete a pair of eyes, and a significant amount of time is also spent on the jaw. Artificial skin for humanoid robots is also created in a dedicated laboratory using special silicone. 
The thickness is measured to fractions of a millimeter, with particular attention given to the face, as the mimicry needs to look lifelike. The elasticity of the skin on the hands is equally important, as it must endure numerous bends and stretches. To make the artificial skin resemble real skin more closely, it is tinted, a process similar to makeup application. Each robot's head contains 29 movable modules that help the mimicry appear as human-like as possible. These modules control the movements of the eyes, eyelids, cheeks, and head turns. The circular mechanism on the robot's chest houses a camera and a complex array of microphones that can isolate human speech from background noise and identify the main speaker. After all the wires and circuit boards are installed, the robot is powered on for the first time, bringing it to life. Each Promobot undergoes more than 10 hours of testing, during which engineers troubleshoot and fix any issues until the robot is working perfectly. One of the final stages is testing the robot's reactions and emotions. Naturally, the more complex the robot, the more functions it has. For example, museum robots are equipped with floor plans to navigate without bumping into exhibits, airport consultants have a receipt printer, and consulate robots have a passport scanner. Diagnostic robots can even be fitted with a breathalyzer upon request. Promobot V4 is fully capable of replacing a live employee. It communicates with people, answers questions, provides consultations, and moves freely within a space. The robot even recharges itself when it detects that its battery is low, so it doesn't need constant supervision. The robot's owner can easily add new phrases, create custom movements, emotions, and even dances, because managing the robot is simple and doesn't require special education. Over the next 20 years, humanoid robots will become an integral part of everyday life. The challenge for global developers will be to ensure their harmonious integration without fueling fears of technological unemployment. Humanoid robotics is not just about replacing human labor, it's about evolving and expanding our capabilities. It's an invitation to rethink the nature of work itself, its functions, efficiency, and the collaboration between humans and machines. Companies like Promobot have the potential to completely change the world by creating perfect assistance that will become an essential part of society. It's only a matter of time. The robots from this company truly deserve respect for their realism and functionality, and are rightfully considered among the most realistic in the world. Write in the comments what you think about the future prospects of Russian robotics. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the Caro Show channel. Also check out our previous videos. Goodbye.